So to show you the actual engraving and so on, we'll just open the dial. So here you have the signature, Thomas Tompion, London. And it's a plate and you can actually see the rivet heads which have slightly distorted the, uh, the plate as it's been made quickly when Tompion and Banger fell out. Nobody really knows why. Like all accurate clocks, Tompion has put um, a shutter here and a little lever on the outside so that you can cock the shutter to wind the clock. And this then gives the maintaining power the extra little spring to keep the movement running once it's wound. The movement, some month going movement, so it only needs winding once a month, but while you wind it, the maintaining power keeps the pendulum ticking away. The case is a beautiful black uh, Japan case, very high quality, just what you'd expect from Tompion, with Doric columns and uh, wonderful spandrels. So in the corners of the dial, we've got these wonderful uh, Indian, as they're called, um, spandrels. And the detail of the spandrels is the most beautiful casting, and then it's been chased to add uh, any detail that might have been lost in the casting. Uh, aren't they beautiful? What more can you say? It's a beautiful Tompion case.